endure, son. I... We need you strong. Okay. Come on, let's go. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Davy, too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got fire and shelter. That's a start. Someone coming towards us. You up ahead. Who's there? Whoa. Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Uh, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean. We don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear.
Let's keep it ah! Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Okay. Let's head down there. Hitch up here. Good. Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of you. and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the train. Arthur, we got a problem. Folks. <laughs> <laughs> There's a corpse right here. Now, I, I just Arthur, need some There's a body of food in the wagon. I hear you. Just gentlemen. keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy.
like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Oh, I'm starving. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. The place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Looks like the poor bastard was married, too, at some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. I'm going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Meet me out here when you're done. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> Well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh.
Get the hell out of here. Go! far in this anyway that looks like a decent horse you should keep him tie him up over there Arthur What's your name, miss? Miss? Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, 
Mike have found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. See, they continue up that way. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. And suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Watch out for this crevice. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Tracks go left. Down here. Davy got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. <laughs> Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Now let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there, boy. Come on, now. 
Hey, look! Over there! You see that? John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on! Up there! that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? Careful here. Show 
about this. Over here! Yeah. It's coming from this way. Okay. Watch out here. Stay low under here. Okay from here. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Come on. Sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. Keep moving then. Come on. John, where are you? John! John, you there? I'm here. Out of the way. That's John. We're coming. Down here. He's down here. Hey! All right! Hot down, Marston! That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but it's good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing! Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry side? Can't argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Uh, you all right? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Look up there. Distract him while you get to the horses. Go! Draw them off. Okay, here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. We're getting you out of here. You'll be fine. 
It's just like a, a dog bite. Uh, you knew a fella? Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. More coming down the hill. Come on, then. Let's get back to the others. Yeah. God damn it, Morgan. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a, a dog bite. <sighs> you knew a fella? Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. More coming down the hill. Stay back. Get out of here. Look out on the right. We got more wolves on the left. Get the hell out of here. Get out. Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Yeah. Just push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. John! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? <laughs> Can we get some help? We need some help here! Come on, help him down. You're alive! You're alive! Come on, here we go. There we go. Oh. Ay, oh. careful, idiotas! It's his leg! Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you, thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <coughs> thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with... We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. strong, we get warm, and we wait. Storm 
breaks, we move. But we're safe here. Warm enough. I guess. You sound doubtful. Not doubtful, just worried. We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, or we get some more money, and we keep heading west. But we're heading east. For now. For now. We got this. We're safe. Stay strong, Jose. Boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lamb, and you lot have all turned yellow. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay, let's go find these car. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this core of their planet. There. Tracks, horses, quite a few of them. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. 
You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Yeah. Gentlemen, this is it. Are we goddamn ready? ready? Ready, Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. There they are. Uh, that's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. All right, let's go pay our old friends a visit. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. Boys, be ready to pick them off from up there. <laughs> sure thing. Good. Come on, let's go. We'll circle around the far side and go down that way, same as Mike and Bill. Like you said. Revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur, Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including Calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on. Deep here. Careful. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running... Hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front.
Get in cover, Arthur. <laughs> that fella smacked you up something stupid, huh? Yeah, so, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. What are you doing? What the hell are you doing? God damn it! All right, boys. Kill these sons of bitches. Kill every last one of these bastards. Keep pushing for. 